Hello, everyone. Welcome to week two. I hope week well went, or week one went well for you. And I'm excited to move into week two. So for week two, we're going to be August 24th to August 28th, the second row here. You're going to be reading chapters one and chapter two from the book. There's a free ebook available from the library, and I have linked the link to the library link here. In addition, you're going to be making an intro video. This is a quick two to three minute video telling me who you are and some of the things you're interested in. So we have some of the um, instructions and things you should be addressing here in this link. Several of you have already posted and you can watch Dr. Kunberger's and my own intro video here if you would like to get an idea. I really like watching the intro videos, so I'm excited to see them. In addition, we're gonna have a studio engagement component. A studio engagement is kind of what we're mimicking as interacting with your group, interacting with your team, interacting with us. So for this week's studio engagement, you're gonna be working with your team who I'm going to be assigning. I still haven't had everybody take the survey yet, so I wasn't able to make groups yesterday. I'm gonna be working on that this morning and if you didn't complete the survey, um, I'll either randomly assign you to a group or maybe I will uh, keep you as a subset and wait and assign you later. I'm still deciding. Anyway, you're going to meet with your group uh, over Zoom or maybe a phone call or Discord or something and discuss what sort of project you're interested in working on. So you're going to choose a data set or a subset of a data set and find one that you're interested in working with when we start managing data using R. So for instance, I'm doing research on sunscreen. I would probably look for a data set related to sunscreen or at least personal care products. Uh, several of you do interesting things like building or concrete recycling. So maybe you could look at a data set related to um, something with building materials. Uh, so talk with your group, see if you can look through these available data and find a group data set that works for your, your group overall. In addition, you're going to develop a team contract. So this is just a quick, relatively painless thing, but we want you to design something to hold your team accountable. So a lot of you in the survey said you're looking for people who, you know, do their share of the work and submit their work on time. And here's where you can put those things in a contract. You know, as a team member, I will do X and you know, you can each sign it and set the expectations for what you are expecting of other people right away. I know oftentimes group projects are very frustrating because one or two people do a majority of the work. And in this course, we are working very hard to make sure that everybody in a group is doing their fair share. So part of that is by constructing a team contract. Lastly, we're going to look at the discussion from this from last week. Make sure that you circle back to the discussion from last week. That'll close on Wednesday and engage in this week's discussion, which is based on last week's reading. So the wicked problems and why this course are going to be discussed in this week's discussion section. So we have some, uh, again, some explanation of what you should be commenting on and you are going to be engaging in the discussion. Last week, the discussion was phenomenal. Everybody had great ideas. They were engaging with everybody else. I had almost everybody in the class commenting or replying. And I was really happy to see how the discussions went last week. Uh, the, once again, the discussion will be open from this Monday until next Wednesday. So you have 10 days to be engaging in the discussion. And this discussion will be based on the previous week's readings. So they're gonna kind of piggyback off each other. In addition, oh, chapter one and chapter two in your book are pretty short. Chapter one is, uh, I think 22 pages, something like that. Chapter two is shorter and there's tables and graphics in it. So please do the reading. We're relying heavily on the fact that you will do the reading. Please do that and um, once again, I have my office hours on Monday mornings on Zoom, and you can email me to set up any other office hours that you would like. And I believe that's all I have for this week. So I hope you guys have a great week. I can't wait to see the intro videos and some of the engagement from this week. 
I will be putting you in groups uh, probably within the next two hours. So look for, look for that. All right. With that, I will uh, sign off. Thanks. Bye.